Okay, we're building a volcano today. A real one. It's going to explode and everything. Arr. Who's excited about it? Me. Who's really excited about it? Me. That's more like it. We've been asking all week to do this. Ready? Start stirring. Make this sticky paste. Are you stirring? Picture, off. keep stirring, bud. Ready? Get into the corner. That's right. Get it all mushy. Mushy paste. <laughs> And this is what's going to help the newspaper stick to the side of the, vo the volcano. This is going to be our cement. Oh, yeah. Okay, let me get in this corner real quick, please. How is this going to be cement? See, what you know what you're doing right now? You're doing just like the cement trucks. <laughs> Spinning it up. Keeping it pasty. All right, the next step is to secure our volcano base to the cardboard. So what I've done is I've put some stick -em on here. I get to do two. Okay, let Victor do two. And then Vivian, did you get to do three? Okay, then Victor, maybe you can put the volcano in the middle of here. So take, take, get rid of the tape. You need to use both hands for this. Now go to the middle of the structure and stick it right, right on there. down. Sure, if that's your middle. Okay, that's good. I don't think we have to press too hard. All right, this is the flower in the water. This is really gloopy. Maybe we'll take off some of that excess. And then Vivian, you're going to take it mm -hmm. and you're going to wrap it around like that. And then we're going to cover this whole thing. Okay? So, Victor, you dip it, and Vivian, you put it on. But you're going to get dirty, so... Yeah, you just get your it. hands in there. Yeah, you can put your hands in it. See? Just go bloop, bloop. And then pull it off, and then just run your fingers down to get the excess bloop off, and then give it to Vivian. Can you uh, can you get the excess off this one? Victor will be a little factory. You don't even have to do that, Victor. You could just put it in, flip it over, flip, <laughs> and then you pull it out, and then excess, please. Go, it's like a factory. Mm -hmm. okay. You Excess. take it out, and I ex. Uh, um, just very lightly. We just want the excess, and uh, let's do the whole finger. There you go. I think Victor's having fun playing with the glue. No, I wanted to do that. You want to switch? Mm hmm. Okay. Let's also do the sides. The sides have excess paste too. I can do it. Okay, here you go, Victor. Can you put this next piece in? Oh, these are a couple of pieces. Good job. There's more excess. Let's get it all off. Victor, mm, is there any more, Mom? Any more what? Cracks. Yeah, we've got lots to do. Yeah, you have lots of cracks. Let's uh, 
Remember, do the edges. Wait, grab the sides. Oh, Mom, look. I wanted Kiddo. to do this. Kiddo, look at that. Now you gotta paste it down with your hand. Or you could do that. Look at that volcano base. Are you going cross eyed, Vivian? <laughs> it looks silly. You're going to fall out of your chair. And now it dries. That is the volcano. I was reading this one. What does it say? A bird's five. Plant pump is a glass of water hole in a whole place. Piece of pump in the glass of water. So it's called pumice. What's pumice? Pumice is rock froth. What's rock froth? Well, when the volcano explodes and the lava comes up, there's lots of different types of lava, but a lot of times they have froth on them where it's mostly the bubbles. It's sort of like the foam in your root beer float. And then when it cools and it dries, it becomes a rock, but it's mostly full of air bubbles. And that is pumice. Do you see the holes in the pumice? You can see this is a. Uh... Have you ever seen a rock float? Uh, I want to see one float. Are we? Do you want to see one float, Vivian? Would that be amazing? Can I try it? Hey, Dad. One? Yeah. Dad, when you put it way over here, it looks... Does it look different? Whoa! A rock that floats? How can it float? It's a magic rock, isn't it? Can yours float, Victor? Ooh, I guess not. That's the difference about these ones. But this one is heavier than this one. That's right. They're different rocks. And this one has holes, and this one doesn't. That's right. Difference. Right You're there. absolutely correct. Sharp as a tack. Whip smart. Victor, can I see with that now? Okay, I think it's Vivian's turn to get a chance with the magnifying glass. So look at the different rocks. So grab both rocks, Vivian, and look underneath each of them one at a time. Hmm. How, both, how did both of them not float? Well, you pointed out a few differences between the rocks. One of them's heavier than the other. One of them has more holes than the other. How about if you let Vivian look at that rock now? And you can make that one float with the pumice. Floats. Do you see any differences, Vivian, between the two rocks? This one stands up easily, but that one does. So that one stands up easier? Okay, I can see it. 
That's one difference. What are these, Mom? After she puts it back in, she's going to give it to me. So right now we are painting our volcano. Are you done painting that side? Do you want me to turn it? Excellent. Man, how many days are we going to wait for this thing to dry off with all of this paint? It's probably just going to dry tonight. And then we should be able to uh, explode it in the morning. Well, in the morning, none of you are. Me and Vivian and Dad are going to only be awake. I'm going to take a while. We're going to be up so early than you, Dad. We'll wake up both of you. You'll just say some a secret in your ear, right, Victor? Yeah. Then to wake you up. Yeah. We'll say something like a secret. And so loud. We're gonna say it. The your bed's gone. What? And you wake up and you, and you look rush. and you look if your bed is still there. And you say, Phew. I thought it was for real. Dad, I'll tell Richard when I'm done. Can you paint the white around the rim at the top? See if we can paint that black. Nope, it won't stick. Darn. That's okay, we'll just cut it off later. Cut what off? The white plastic. We'll try to catch it on. Mom, what are you saying get away to? Okay, paint the base. Good job, Victor. Vivian, you want to paint the base down there, too? I think she got interested in doing it. Okay. So I'm just going to do the bottom of the base. Wow, it's looking great. I'm getting all the final touches, Dad. You're, doing the the you're getting all the final touches? Yeah. Paper mache. Here is our black volcano. Shiny and painted. Check it out. We just need to dry it. And then make an eruption. Can I also do it? Yes, of course. We have more ingredients to put in, so. Can I do all the other ingredients? Pour it in, honey. Can I see it drain down, honey? 
How is it that I was bringing down that? Because you have to watch. Just give it a minute. Let's uh, shake it a little bit. You should add more. Keep going. Baking soda is sodium bicarbonate and the vinegar is acid. And when they mix, they make carbon dioxide. It bubbles up. You want to shake the volcano again? Yeah, you can shake it more aggressively. Tilt it back and forth. There you go, you're mixing the ingredients right now. Add vinegar. It's already going. Yeah, I know, but add vinegar. Vivian, come here. No, you don't have to shake it now. We have a, a, a volcano explosion. Hey, look, 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 Vivian. Look at the top of the volcano. Dad. Yeah, it's okay. Look at that. Look, look, look. <gasps> look. <laughs> You're more worried about the roly poly than the volcano exploding in your backyard? Ah! Look out! It's not a real one. Dad, how are we going to watch this one? <laughs> you two are worried about cleaning up and roly polies? the best one yet. No. There we go. Here we go. Whoa! Look out! Ah! It's an explosion! Earthquake! say a mixed bag of results. <laughs> it's hard to compete with wheelbarrows. <laughs>